Today we're looking at five different film stocks you definitely have to try. So to kick it off for this shoot, we shot two film stocks. We shot Ilford Delta 400, which we had pushed to 800. Uh, we also shot Former Pan 400, which we pulled to 200, just so we could see what those would look like. So I've shot Delta 400 a couple of times and I must say that I really love how it looks when it's pushed to 800. The images become more contrasty and quite punchy, the green becomes very noticeable but I love the overall characteristics of the images. It was our first time shooting former pan 400 and I think pulling it to 200 was a really good idea. The images came out less contrasty which I think was really fitting for this second look. So for the second shoot, we shot a box of Ilford HP5, some Sinistil Double Black, and an expired box of uh, Ilford FP4. And I have to say that um, I really loved shooting Ilford HP5. It really had some fine grain and it had a lot of uh, latitude, uh, especially when I was messing around with it in post.
Sinistral Double Black really surprised me out of the batch of film that I shot and it's definitely become one of my faves. Um, I really love how rich it rendered the blacks and just the overall contrasty feel of the images. So for this last shoot, we shot a box of Ilford FP4. Uh, this was one of the very first film stocks that I shot when I was starting out in film. And I've just always loved the contrasty image that it renders. And I think coupled with its fine grain, it makes for an amazing black and white film stock. Please like the video and subscribe to the channel. Also follow us on the socials and we'll definitely see you on the next one. Thanks for tuning in.